Epson's Moverio BT100 is controlled by a unique handheld trackpad controller. After this quick tour, you'll be enjoying content on your Moverio in no time. The button on top of the controller is the power button for both the controller and the headset. A long press will turn the unit on or off, and a short press will put the unit into sleep mode. The most prominent navigational tool on the controller is the trackpad. Use this pad to navigate menus and use apps. Below the trackpad are the three standard Android keys, Home, Menu, and Back. These keys will help you navigate the Moverio menus with ease. Centered below these keys are the four-way directional keys and the Enter key. There are also keys for switching between 2D and side-by-side -side 3D modes, and for quickly setting brightness levels. The micro SD card slot is on the left side of the device. The audio jack, which can be used with your own earphones, is on the bottom of the controller along with the micro USB port, which is used for charging Moverio and transferring content from your PC or Mac. We'll discuss transferring content in more detail in another video. To connect the Moverio headset, plug it into the bottom of the controller. The Moverio headset features a removable lens shade, nose pad, and can be worn comfortably over prescription glasses when using the included clips. For audio, simply plug the included earbuds into the headphone ports found on both sides of the headset. You can also use your own earphones if you prefer. To get to know Moverio even better, visit www.epson.com slash Moverio. Moverio. Enhance your world.